and let's ride, ride for pop, pop, the life for pop, pop, pop off the glock, glock, the thug in the dumb stuff, stop, 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 Hello, I am coming on to do a reading for the collective. It is just going to be a general energy check-in. So it may or may not resonate with you. Hold on. Okay. Sorry. Just take what resonates and leave what does not. Don't make something for your situation if it doesn't fit or does not make sense for you. Okay, I hope everyone's doing well. I'm just going to shuffle and then I'll pull the energy around the reading and pull the reading, okay? Okay, spirit. What is the energy around this reading, please? Energy around this reading, please. <coughs> Excuse me. Okay. 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 Disappointed and. I'm gonna get a few more. Yeah, somebody could be disappointed that you're moving forward on a path that you're on or you could be disappointed in some sort of okay so you could be disappointed in something maybe you're overwhelmed in some sort of situation that you're in or somebody could be disappointed about like a decision you're making uh, like a life choice that you're making um, either way I feel like there's forward movement either way either either situation you could either be overwhelmed in like in like different situations in life maybe like you have a lot that you're that you're doing or taking on hold on I think I'm gonna sneeze hold um, okay no I'm not okay so you could either have a lot that you are responsible for right now and you may feel like you could be taking on a lot for the age you're at and you feel like you don't want to let people or situations down. You may be calling on something that you lean on for support to get you through different situations that may feel like they're weighing heavy on you to be able to move forward in different times in your life. I feel like that's more of what I'm picking up than there could be this like outside type of feeling like people are um disappointed that maybe you like I feel like there's this like this type of energy around you where it's like people are disappointed that you didn't end up like not being like immature or like that you didn't end up like in this immature like uh flighty energy which is maybe maybe you appear as being young or being like in maybe you come off as not being as responsible as you are maybe you're somebody that's very responsible but you appear like you are in this like younger energy even though you could be really responsible and have a lot that you take care of and so it's like people are disappointed that you didn't meet the standards or like not standards maybe people didn't have standards and you like 
um, didn't meet their expectations of not living up to, like, this disappointment that they wanted you to meet. Which is funny because disappointment, disappointed is here. And so, so that could have people feeling, like, overwhelmed. Like, oh, you are, like, um, actually responsible and that makes people feel overwhelmed. Like, that you are not um, disappointing in some area or in all areas in some way. So I feel like that's the energy I'm picking up in this overall energy. Um, it may or may not resonate. Just take what resonates, okay? Um, okay. Okay, so you might have worked really hard to work on um, your stability. You could be someone that's really private or you value your privacy. Um, you, I feel like, are somebody that is very supportive or is supportive of other people, especially if people are younger than you, you may be really supportive of helping people um, meet like their goals or things that they're working on. Um, if, if it, I feel like this really does have to do with people that maybe you are, could be a mentor for in some way or you work with on some level, uh, you could be protective of people that you feel like um, you may look after. Because uh, I feel like you could be somebody that is like, you may show up as, if, if you are somebody that's younger in age, you may be in a more mature energy. If you're not somebody that's younger in age, you just have um, this like really private lifestyle or you may be a really private person and you do stuff to, um, I feel like mentor or protect people that are younger. Um, you may be really assertive when it comes to helping people meet their goals or work in different partnerships or work in like alliances with coming into some place of being able to really be happy in the space they're in as far as like uh, different types of healing or bringing in like collaborations when it comes to um, celebrating their own personal space or the world that they're in um out of different like uh maybe confusion or confusing times that they've gone through this may have come from a time where you were not as emotionally stable or you went through a time where your emotions were uh up and down or uh were not were not as balanced maybe you went through a difficult time where decisions were hard to make or you had to um you could have had to go through your own healing or work in um like some sort of independent setting to gain control over maybe your emotions or maybe this is like therapy or something or just some sort of group um, group collective effort so it could have been like AA or anything like that or just like in like a family setting or working in some sort of group where you had to gain or balance out your emotions in some way out of a difficult situation so that may have brought you into a time where you really respect people maybe that are younger that are going through the same type of situation and you feel this um this desire or this like uh it makes you you may feel this like having this equal give and take when it comes to um bringing that same support in to others especially if they may be in a younger energy or at like a younger age in their life um hold on one second okay okay sorry okay so i think i was saying you may feel like you feel like having an equal give and take with people that are younger than you because of situations that you've gone through as far as your own um, maybe therapy or something that you've gone through to get a balance around your emotions. So I'm going to pull a few more.
Yeah, we have the Six of Pentacles, so this is the equal give and take I was talking about. Um, and then the Two of Pentacles is that balance, bringing in, um, like, balancing out your priorities, being, like, like managing day-to-day -day things and your routines, being really efficient. Um, when it comes to anything where there's confusion or anything that's unclear, anything that brings anxiety or any type of illusions, bringing balance into that. Uh, but you may do this. You may, you may actually be like a therapist or work in some sort of maybe like a guidance counselor or like a, like some sort of, the King of Cups and the Six of Pentacles, Two of Pentacles, and the Page of Swords. You may just work with youth in some way. Um, no, the Four of Pentacles and the Ten. So this isn't some sort of foundation um, with a traditional setting, solid foundation. Um, and then there's Four of Pentacles to the Ten of Pentacles. So this may have brought you from a time where you had to hold back. You may have, okay, so you could have gone through a time where you were, um, maybe you were not as emotionally balanced and you went through your own um, inner healing or guidance, reflection, um, your own inner work and found some sort of, I'm oh, sorry, my ear is itching found some sort of balance that brought you into this place where you were able to work uh, in in some in, in a foundation. Uh, this is like a traditional setting. Uh, it's rooted in tradition. So this could be therapy. This could be group counseling. This could be um, anything with tradition when it comes to like working. I feel like this is with youth or like younger, uh, like a younger type of setting. Um, but you may have done this in that and it may have brought you from being like in this energy of having to hold on to your resources, maybe being closed off in a way, maybe having to save everything that came in and brought you into this um, ability to be able to have security around your sense of comfort, being really solid in your foundation, having this wealth around like family and um, could have brought you into a place where you're really respected where you are and really balanced in your emotions and in your foundation. Um, and I feel like that that's the equal give and take that you want to bring into other people or that you want to bring other people into um, is that type of that type of healing. So the overall energy was that you may come off as this energy that is impulsive or you may come off as this younger energy and people may be overwhelmed that you have this forward movement to you that um, is really responsible because there may be this idea that you are not as responsible as you are and there could be this disappointment like that you are really responsible for for the person you are because there could be this perception or misconception about you that you're not in this um in this responsible type of personal empowerment um but i feel like i feel like you're somebody that has this quick movement forward towards your goals and your desires in your dreams and it's it's something I feel like you've learned to do by depending on something that's um, guiding you something that you lean on as far as a faith religion a spiritual practice anything like that um, even your own sense of higher sense of self and even though there could be this like disappointment maybe from people around you or just people outside of you I do feel like you have this quick movement forward that drives you towards your goals and your dreams and that um you do have a lot of success coming in with the nine of pentacles that you're in this energy of being able to kind of do and um achieve what you want so that you're able to stay in this this lifestyle that is really comfortable okay so i'm gonna pull an advice card
when it when a door doesn't open, don't waste your energy trying to make it open. It's closed for a reason. You're being redirected to something far bigger and better. Endings are part of the cycle of life. They make way for wonderful new beginnings and opportunities.